for you. Hello and welcome to the video. In this video I'll be giving you an early look at the new Nuka Tap Flow Control model. For those that are not aware of the Nuka Type faucets, here is a quick recap. Nuka Tap released this year and comes from the core designers of Intertap. There is a building variety of different colours and finishes and types. They also fully support the previous add-on pieces such as the Stout Spout, Growler Filler and Borlock Spout. The main benefits that Nuka Taps enjoy over Intertap, Ultratap and other competitors' faucets in the marketplace are as follows. Firstly, there's an improved body design which reduces thermal mass, which makes the faucet lighter and much faster to cool down, which significantly reduces foaming during the first pause, or pause not made in a relatively quick succession. There is also a vastly improved shuttle design, and it is its shape that gave these new faucets their name. This is cheaper to replace, more hygienic, with a much improved flow. There are also new seals. EDPM seals are now used and these have a much improved better resistance to acidic chemicals found in cleaning powders as well as sour beers. In the end this promotes a longer life for your seals. Due to this improved sealing and new design you can now use larger and heavier tap handles than before without the same chance of leaks. Let's start by having a look now at how this new Nuka tap looks before we go deeper into its details. This is the stainless steel version. As you will no doubt see, this is very shiny and clean looking. Unlike the other Nuka Taps, this faucet is supplied with an extra piece which is loose until you fit it. One great piece of news is that you can add an auto-close spring to this flow control version like the other Nuka Tap faucets in the range, and it fits between this new component and the body. This new component is part of the new flow control design, which essentially leads to less foam and better pour performance like the rest of the range. Having a flow control faucet with this feature is somewhat rare in the world market. You may also be wondering how the Nuka Tap looks compared to the Intertap flow control model, so let's do a side by side comparison. The main quickly noticeable difference is being weight and a more refined aesthetic, or put another way, the Nuka Tap is the Intertap after long term gym membership from a visual perspective. I have used the Intertap flow control model for quite some time, and in its day it was the best flow control faucet you could buy, but its reign as the flow control king has now ended due to the release of the Nukatab FC. As my regular viewers will know, I have been quite vocal in the past that flow control faucets can be rather misleading. This is essentially because they were very limited in terms of actual flow control, and if you watch my previously released flow control video I have given the advice in the past that flow control is far better managed via correct pressure and beer lines combined with flow control on the actual keg end. The Nukochat flow control model now changes this with a whole new design. The main issue with the previous designs such as those from Intertap and Perlick flow control models as shown on screen now in component form is that they had an aggressive transition whereby the flow of the beer went through several small cross drilled holes in a flow control mechanism. I have now highlighted these parts for both models on screen with red circles and I hope you can clearly see these small holes and how this works. This design creates turbulence that increases the foam generated in the flow control mechanism once you pass the sweet spot of flow control. So as you now understand, this is a very limited design. In contrast, here is the breakdown of how a Nukatap flow control model is put together. On the far left you see the new component that controls flow as soon as your beer enters the faucet. Then we have the optional auto close spring which fits inside this sleeve. When fully assembled this sleeve is positioned up here at the front on the faucet to work with the flow control lever. So you can see that instead of going through small holes like other flow control methods this system controls the flow in a very different way in combination with the classic bomb shape of the shuttle that is featured in the whole range. The over molded design of the Nukatap shuttle and this new flow control system allows for flow control with a fast mover transition with greater laminar flow thus reducing turbulence and excessive foaming. So I hope you now fully understand why I added to the title screen at the very start of this video that this is flow control with a difference. Now here is a question for you. If this flow control model interests you, would you like it to be available in matte black as well as stainless steel? Please let me know in the comments section of this video. If you have any questions or comments, please add them to either the comments section of this video or use this channel's Facebook group. If you are not a member yet, then the links are shown on screen. 
This now brings this video to a close. If you have any questions, then please let me know via YouTube or Facebook. I do hope that you found this video to be useful, interesting and enjoyable. If appropriate, then please like this video on YouTube. And if you've not done so already, then please subscribe. I regularly post new content. Happy brewing.